As we continue to track Zeta, both Bibb and Houston counties are prepared to take action. Brianna Richardson checked in with both counties to hear their plans. I spoke with the Houston County Engineer and the Bibb County EMA Director. They both tell me they're prepared to take action if needed. Bibb County EMA Director Spencer Hawkins says they've been tracking the storm closely. We work closely with the National Weather Service out of Peachtree City. They've had a couple of special webinar briefings to update us on the storm, the impacts that we may see. And over in Houston County, the county's public works engineer says they're checking all their storm equipment. Making sure our equipment is uh, working properly, gassed up and, and whatnot. Uh, things like generators and chainsaws, uh, sump pumps, uh, grappling trucks to pick up the uh, debris on the side of the road. Both counties are prepared to do all they can. As any storm, a hurricane starts approaching the southeast United States, we start paying attention to it. We uh, follow the track, we see what the impacts are going to be, um, and then we start notifying our emergency management team. So we do know that uh, these storms can change on a dime, and so we need to be ready, and we are ready. Every storm event's uh, different, whether rain or, or ice conditions or whatever, but generally on, on almost all of them, we start out by, you know, like I mentioned earlier, getting our equipment ready, making sure everything's ready to go, and, and, then, you, and then having the employees uh, take uh, action if we need to. Now, both Hilde and Hawkins encourage everyone to stay safe, and if you have to drive, don't go through any flooded water. In Houston County, Brianna Richardson, 13 WMAZ News. All right, thanks, Brianna. We're going to continue to update on the latest information. The big story for us is mainly wind, some rain, but it's mainly going to be wind. As the